Vodafone IoT are at the Atlas Flight Test Centre here in Spain, where we're going to demonstrate how our mobile network can control commercial drones. These drones have to fly beyond the line of sight of the operator. Now, to do this, you need to have a network that's available everywhere, but more importantly, to actually have the ability to detect and locate that drone in the airspace. So we are demonstrating how the mobile technology is going to help the sector take off. And it's going to do that in three ways, mainly. Uh, the first thing that it's going to provide is the identity and registration. So every drone will have a name attached. The second thing is connectivity, not just for command and control, also for real-time, high-definition video streaming. That helps piloting the drone, of course. And the third thing that the mobile technology is going to provide is quite unique with a system that we've developed that's called radio positioning system that can locate the drones even if they don't want to cooperate, acting as a radar. It's important that um, the air traffic control system has a real-time feed of the position of every device. Commercial drones have the potential to transform many industries. In manufacturing, they can be used to take goods from one place to another, either inside or outside of the factory. In logistics, they can be used to move goods quickly and swiftly from one place to another, avoiding traffic jams. And increasingly, we're seeing the potential for drones in emergency situations, where we can put up a mobile network and actually give people connectivity quickly and swiftly without having to repair infrastructure. I can even imagine in the future that drones will be used as an autonomous taxi, where we can actually use the drone to get from one place to another. So with Vodafone IoT, the future is certainly exciting.